There are professionals um, that actually focus on moisture testing. There's some that actually can go as far as forensically analyze a concrete slab as well, more than just testing. Up until recently, um, historically, there were no there was no training or certifications for testing. Um, that was a problem because even in my history, when I, when I see moisture test results coming across my desk, there were times when I would see at least 50% of those tests were performed incorrectly. Um, that's a very, very dangerous thing to do is to test something and not test it correctly because you're basing your installation systems on faulty, what potentially faulty information. So professionals out there, there is now the IC or II that has a training and certification program that is accredited um, and it, it covers um, all of the major moisture testing processes that we have through ASTM today. There are multiple types and methods to test a concrete slab. You have um, the, the old method, which is calcium chloride, uh, which we don't recommend anymore. Um, very little of that is done today. Um, not because that testing process was necessarily wrong, it's just people didn't understand fully on how to test what, using that method and we're getting false results. Today we have digital equipment um, where we can test the uh, body of the concrete slab and we can also test the surface of the concrete slab. And there's various ASTMs for those. Um, we have multiple types of equipment, for example if the predominant one today is through our ASTM F2170 and it's the in-situ probe test. We have a sleeve, you drill a hole into the concrete. Basically on your typical slab you're going to get to 40 percent depth. You'll let this acclimate, get this into the hole, you'll let it acclimate for 24 hours. And then you have an RH probe such as this one that actually goes into the sleeve and will tell me the relative humidity of the concrete at that 40 percent depth. Another method, um, which we also recommend um, in tangent with probe testing, is a non-invasive meter that actually just sets right on top of the concrete and just gives me an immediate number. The number value from here is different than the number value that I have from here. They're too different. But I can get um, an, a good idea of what the surface is and I get a good idea of what the body of the concrete is. There's also another one from Protometer um, that is also a non-invasive test and it can give me an idea of the water content in the surface of the slab.